the launch codes. Don't lie to me, you motherfucker. Oh my fucking god. You shot Rodney and Pete. It'll be more where that came from if you don't give me the damn launch codes. I sold code. them as soon as I got them. Fuck. Just like that? Yes. I sold them on the internet. Have you heard of it? It takes like two seconds to sell shit on there. Guys, please. We, we really need a doctor. Do, do these guys have insurance? What? No. No, 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 no. That's not how this works. Okay? You're supposed to launch the nukes yourself. All right? I, I walks up in here. Okay? We fight. I kill you. I win. Then I stop the nuke countdown at one second. All right? You're doing this villain thing all wrong. No. Villains do villain shit wrong, man. This ain't no fucking movie, man. I ain't got time for that bullshit, man. I do my shit and I move on, bro. As simple as that. Hey, can we please get an ambulance for my niggas? Bro, you are the worst villain ever. You killed Rodney and Pete. Who's the real villain? They're bad guys. So killing them is justified. Bad guys? R Rodney? The one that you murdered? was a middle school teacher for the mentally disabled, and he volunteered at the orphanage every weekend as a mentor. Okay, he was a fucking sweetheart. And Pete? He was a fucking asshole, okay? But he had a wife and kids. He was an amazing husband and an amazing father. But, but they, they was henchmen. Though. Okay! They had lives, nigga! So what if they wanted to be henchmen on the side to make some extra money, motherfucker? It's a pandemic! Niggas is doing anything nowadays! My fucking friend make light bulbs! He fucking make light bulbs! Fuck. Can somebody please get Pete's wife on the phone, please? Please. Hey, man. I, Excuse I, me. Excuse me. I'm sorry. Just wait one second. I have to tell Mrs. Oh, wait. No, Miss Vanderbilt that she's a widow. And little Kyle that his dad is never going to be able to make it to any more of his Little League games. Fucking dick. Mrs. Vanderbilt, hey, good evening. But, oh, you're putting the baby to sleep. Oh, um, I'm sorry to bother. He refused to believe that Cory Baxter is the superior waifu. You know, you're totally lame. 